I'm a student studying chemistry in UC Berkeley, so a science student, but I'm really interested in combining science and art together, especially using scientific method into the investigation of art, see if it's real or fake, and do that sort of analysis by using different scientific instruments such as uh, IR and Raman spectroscopy. They all sound really fascinating to me. I'm a Tonka painter and uh, this, the last two days have been fabulous. I have learned so much more about uh, the Tonka sculpture and um, have gained a new appreciation and a whole new perspective from listening to Anne's presentations and her vast amount of knowledge and just every aspect of the Tonka and her appreciation of every aspect of it, things that I've missed, things that I, you know, would overlook in my own relationship with the practicing Tonka and it was just stellar, stellar, totally, it, it is definitely going to add to my practice having taken this, so thank you Anne. I learned how to spot a fake. So hopefully when I make my way to Tibet, I'll be able to get an authentic Tonka. Maybe not an ancient one from the 1400s, but definitely an authentic one from an actual like painter. So in traditional practice, that's like, that's the key to it. <laughs> I love Anne's class. I learned a lot about Tonkas that I never knew before. And now I'm interested and willing to learn more. I've worked with Tonkas in the past in my conservation practice, and now I'm going to take the learning and experiences of these past two days and your great depth of knowledge from your lifetime of professional experience and lifetime experience and your knowledge, both practical and philosophical, and put that to practice in my daily work life. Thank you.